Hey, what's up peeps? I hope you guys are doing well. Today, I'm gonna discuss how 2023 went for me. This is December. We are almost approaching the year's end. So, this year was not my best year. I'm gonna keep it real with you guys. It was a lot of ups and downs. I had to make some major life changes. Some of which I'm not very happy about, but that's part of life. I'm sure everybody has to accept that and everybody has to adapt as life changes. As you grow up, things come up and sometimes shit happens. You cannot always be in charge. I'm not going to let that hold me down. All I want to say is that I hope these lessons that I learned this year will make me a stronger person, a better person. And as long as I learn from these lessons, I do not consider them failures. So I'm 26 years old. I turned 26 this year. And life is really starting to change now. I'm in my mid-20s. A lot of friendships are drifting apart. People are starting to get married. People are starting to move out, move away. All types of situations. I learned to accept that. I have to adapt, I have to move on. What I realized is that the best thing anyone can do in this situation is embrace these changes and be happy and not be happy. What is happiness, right? <sighs> it's not easy talking in front of a camera without a script because I'm just making these things up without any written script. And my thoughts are all over the place, so I'm trying to organize them together. I'm starting to feel that I'm not a, you know, I'm not a teenager anymore. I mean, I'm not that old either, don't get me wrong, I'm still young. I'm not an old head or anything, but I just don't have the energy of a teenager anymore. Obviously, you cannot stop time. Time and tide do not wait for anybody, right? The best thing I can do in this situation is keep my focus, stay disciplined, and just do what I need to do. I think there are two different types of people. The first kind is the mood-oriented people. So the mood-oriented people, they make decisions based on their feelings and their mental state. And... This is not the type of person that you can rely on because they might say something to you, but if their mental state changes, if they're in a bad mood or something comes up, they're very easy to change their mind because their decisions are based on their mood. Whereas the second kind of people are the goal-oriented people. So these people, they will always try to keep their words. They will do what needs to be done no matter what they feel like they might be going through a lot of shit they might have the worst day but they will still try to keep their words and they will try to stick to the plan the moral of the story is that I wanna be a goal-oriented person I do not wanna do things based on my moods motivation comes and goes you have to stay disciplined I hope I'm making sense because I think I'm talking a lot of gibberish right now to keep it simple, I'm working on my discipline, I'm working on my focus, I'm trying to stay on my grind, do what I need to do, push out all these videos, continue what I started, and uh, all the best to you guys. I hope you guys are also working on your goals. Nothing worthwhile in life comes easy, so keep going, do not stop, there's light at the end of the tunnel. I hope you guys nothing but the best for the upcoming year and once again I appreciate you guys watching my videos and I hope that you will continue doing so next year. Have a good one. Take care guys.